A zombie satellite has risen from the dead in space. Let me explain. Last year, researchers detected powerful bursts of radio waves whose origins they couldn't initially determine. The radio wave detected was unusually strong. Typically, such signals come from distant galaxies, but this one originated within the Milky Way. We got all excited, thinking maybe we'd discovered a new pulsar or some other object, said Clancy James, an associate professor at Curtin University's Institute of Radio Astronomy in Australia, speaking to new scientists. However, researchers now believe the signal came from a NASA satellite that had been long thought to be non-functional. The zombie satellite in question is Relay 2, which launched in 1964 and believed to have gone offline in 1967. A pre-print study, which is not yet peer-reviewed, found that the pulse lasted just 30 nanoseconds, which led researchers to conclude it wasn't a deliberate transmission. They hypothesized the burst may have been caused either by an impact from a foreign object or by a buildup of electrical charge. Researchers currently think the latter, a buildup of electrostatic discharge, is more likely. The study notes, as a very early spacecraft, Relay 2 may have been constructed from a materials capable of holding greater charge and hence producing stronger ESD events. It has long been known that ESD causes radio frequency pulses. This event is exciting researchers as it could lead the way into further understanding electrostatic discharge from satellites. What do you think of the zombie satellite? Let us know in the comments.